Well, folks, we are at the Goat River. We are on day 38. And as you can tell, I have my work shirt on, so I think today is going to be a bit of an industrious day. I want to go get some stuff done today. I'm going to start by uh, having a little something to eat, and then i got to put water in the trailer. Once that's done, then I can get the blue tote out of the back of the truck, and I think I'm going to go look for some firewood. I can't have a fire, but I can stockpile for later. So that's going to be the plan today, I think. And hopefully uh, get my fan wet somewhere along the way, too. That's kind of part of the plan, too. Now that we're here, I know I can find some gold here somewhere. So that'll be part of today's activities as well, I'm sure. So we'll uh, see how the day goes. Welcome to Zorback, Zorback Adventures. Adventures. Follow me this summer as I travel the BC Kootenays in the Canadian Rocky Mountains. Well, breakfast has been had. Water has been done. I think it's time to go have a little look up the road here. So uh, I'm going to go for a drive and scout out some wood and maybe try and get a pan wet.
halfway up Chadwick. And I was hoping to find some wood up here, but uh, I guess they must have burned all these piles last winter. That really sucks that there was a lot of wood in here yet that could have been uh, salvaged, but uh, there's no such luck now. Piles are gone. Well, here's a uh, beautiful little spot. One that you definitely do not want to go over the edge. It is straight down. I'm going to toss some rocks off this one for sure. a nice little view of the uh, Goat River Valley, or at least part of it anyway. That's the road down there we came in on. This is the cliff here where I'm just throwing rocks off of. Good fun, good fun. Airborne. Well, I think I'm going to take this piece a little bit burnt on the outside, but uh, it uh, missed the main fire, so it should be fine underneath. I'll know right away when I cut into it.
Well, I got a bit of a load already. It's not a huge amount, but it's just stuff laying around, so uh, it's coming home. It's all fur. off a little bit of wood. Not a whole lot, but uh, not bad for putzing around for a couple hours. Problem is, uh, my saw don't like it when it gets hot. It runs for a little while when you first fire it up, and then uh, once it's hot, you can't get it restarted. It don't like to run. It's just too hot outside. It's uh, 32 degrees again, so the saw works for a little bit, so you get what you can cut, and then once uh, you can't get it fired up, you shut her down. What do you do? Well, the other thing up there uh, is uh, I usually go up that Chadwick uh, cut. But I guess this last winter they must have burned all the piles. So I was getting a lot of pretty decent wood out of them piles. And they are now all gone. Burnt, so that's a shame. But uh, I'll find another spot to get some more wood. There's a little bit more up there yet. I spotted some more along the way down. and. Uh, I will go back and probably get that, but I couldn't, I would have got it today had the saws kept running, but uh, wasn't in the cards, so 
No big deal, I'm back at camp now. I'm going to get the wood off the truck and uh, I may run to town. I need some uh, hydraulic fluid for my splitter, so if I can find some hydraulic fluid then I can get my uh, splitter to go full length again. It only goes about halfway right now and then it runs out, so top that up, it should work fine. So that might be the plan uh, this afternoon yet, so we'll see. Well, sunset here, 7.23. So oh, it's uh, going down a fair bit earlier here than uh, it was at uh, Perry Creek. So I get less sun here, less voltage on the panels, so it's not not as good for me, but it is what it is. So if i got to run the Jenny for a bit, I will run the Jenny. I might do that tonight anyway because I want to get the hot water tank fired up. So Jenna, Jenny will be running for an hour, so I'll charge batteries at the same time, but uh, I'll wait for a bit. Because the panels are still getting a little bit of light right now. Even though the sun's behind there, it's still bright out. So they are still charging a bit. So I'll give it a half an hour and then I'll probably fire up uh, the generator and get my hot water going. The usual stuff. Potato pack. Brats. I'm not going to go into detail. You've seen it. Been there and done that. Well, it's starting to get a little dark out, as you can well tell. I didn't get everything done that I wanted to get done today. I didn't get my gold pan wet, but uh, I did get some wood. I got water. I did a little bit of laundry. And I uh, had a shower. Got hot water. So, And I got my good shirt on again. I don't know if you can see that. It might be too dark, but uh, it's not my good shirt. going to be out working again tomorrow. I got some more wood that I seen there today that I'm going to go and try and get. So that's tomorrow's plan in the morning before it gets too hot. And my saws don't run. <laughs> so, and then after that I think I'm going to go to town because I do need to get hydraulic fluid for sure now that I got a pile of wood starting to pile up here. I got to get some uh, splitting done. So, but yeah, that's it for tonight and we'll see what tomorrow brings.